Hello and welcome to the Switch Underground. It is the first Friday of the month, which means that it is time for Discover Indies. Now, this program was pioneered by Indie Gamer Chick on Twitter. It's where I saw it for the first time. And what you do is you take your respective digital shop, I guess, for whatever platform you play on, PC, uh, Switch, PlayStation, Xbox, whatever, and you find an indie title that you've never heard of before, and you buy it and play it and report on it. So for me, reporting on it means I take a first look. Now, I don't know anything about this game. Uh, ooh, that's loud. Um, it is the pub it's published by Merge Games, and it was developed by, let me get this name right, uh, Retalica Games and Baroque Decay. It, it was a bit of an early title. It came out on October 19th, 2017. The Count Lucinor. Lucanor. Right? It's kind of a bit of a old school vibe. Bit of a MIDI track here. It doesn't put me off. It's just different. We're gonna go new game. Don't care about the options. I probably should have checked the options. That little vampire dude's pretty cool. Okay. Once upon a time, there lived a really poor baby called Hans. Hello, Hans. Intro's a little choppy. Hans is in the grass. Hans was downhearted. He wanted to be an adult. And he had a doggo. He was happy with his doggo. As I am happy with this delicious vanilla chai tea. If you're new to the channel, that's what we do here. We drink tea and play games. He wanted to explore faraway places, find treasures, and visit lavish castles. Same. Hans is degrading in quality. Okay, he's back up. However, as his father had left to fight the war, Hans had to stay home and help his mom. Hello. But today, Hans was really happy. Imagine. This is actually the origin story. It's his 10th birthday. It's Hans Gruber. Shoot the glass. No? 10th birthday? Harry Potter style? Mom, I'm back. Do you know what day it is today? Of course I know. You're 10 years old today. Happy birthday? Yeah. Have you bought me any presents? Maybe a toy? Slow down there, Hans. Hans, my dear, you know we have almost no money since your dad went to war. But mom, it's my B-Day. Do we have any sweets to eat? I'm sorry, there's nothing special. Come on, help me set the table. Now, now, come on. Don't play. Well, enough's enough. All kids in the village have presents and sweets for their birthday. They even throw parties. Hans? I'm sick of this house, I'm sick of not having toys, I'm sick of being poor as a church mouse. I understand now why dad isn't coming back. Oh my god, this stings, dude. Where are you going? I'm leaving. I've just turned 10. I'm a grown ass man. That ass wasn't in there. This is a family channel, by the way. If you're new, welcome. Hans, please. I'm going in search of fortune and I'm not ever coming back. I'll be an explorer, even better. I'll be a prince in a castle. Goodbye, mother. All right, dog. Let's go see Professor Oak. Oh, wait. Hans, wait. Are you really leaving? You're still too young. You may think you're a grown-up, but you're only ten. Besides, life is really hard outside, and the woods can be really dangerous for you. I don't care. I'm really strong, and I've been alone in the woods many times. If you're really leaving, at least let me do what I can to help you. I've got some things for you. Of course, I don't need your help. This cane belonged to my father, your grandpa, and it has great sentimental value to me. I'm sure it'll help you on your journey. A cane? Really? You got a cane. <laughs> this is all the money we've got we got left. Take it and spend it wisely. You got three gold coins. Finally, this is all we had to eat. Eat your food slowly, it will last longer. Or you could eat Mm-hmm. You've got some cheese. And this is it. I can't give you anything else, Hans. Please don't go off the road. Be a good boy and remember, I'll be there if you want to come back. Dude. Story time. To interact with things, you have to be next to them and press A. When I was young, every kid does this. You go to run away, right? I packed a suitcase when I was like eight. 
I stood at the front door, and before I left, I just cried. And you know what? My parents, they didn't care. And if I would have tried to pull some shit like Hans, they would have busted my ass. Been like, yeah, okay, you're leaving. Uh, get in the house. Oh. Spittle will love this bone. You've got a bone. I'm, I'm thinking I just read everything in the America Online You've Got Mail voice. Here it is. You've got a yellow... You... I'm not getting a yellow shirt. Spittle. I've got something for you. Spittle, I can't play with you anymore. I go on adventures just like Dad did. I might not be coming back for a long time. Hey, but where's your bone? It has to be around here. Yeah. It seems he wants his bone. To give him the bone, I should open my inventory with, <laughs> with a minus and equip it. I can also change fast between the most important items with Eleanor. There you go, Spittle. There's your bone. <laughs> You've given Spittle the bone. I have to go now. Take care of mom and don't go away. You know, this reminds me of like a game you would make in like Q-Basic. Not that that's bad, it's just the style. He looks distracted with the bone. I better leave now. Why wouldn't we take the dog with us? He's our buddy. Swinging. Actively swinging. This is raising my EXP. Oh. But what am I doing? Now that I'm old, I can't play with the swing anymore. No. Do it, Hans. But what am I doing now that... I could have gone Zoolander. Do it, Hansel. Let's eat this bird. What's up, bud? No? I'm happy I don't have to fetch water from this darned well anymore. I'm happy I don't have to fetch water from this darned well anymore. I'm just kidding. Alright, where's my... Oh. Okay, X opens... Can we eat some cheese? Let's not eat the cheese. Cut the cheese. Yes, I had some cabbage today. But, what's on this tree? I think I'm taking what I've hidden in the tree hollow. Oh god. You've got three chestnuts. That is not what I hid in the tree hollow when I was young. I grew up in the forest, which means... I walked on the roads a lot to go to school in all sorts of weather. But, the great thing about growing up in the middle of nowhere is you find discarded, um... I was gonna tell that story, but then this is a family channel. Magazines of an adult nature, that's all I'm saying. And that's what I would hide. Alright, I guess we're done with this screen. Time to leave. Oh, now we're playing through the, uh... The Count Lucanor. Starring Hans. Fetch us a bunny, Hans. Use the cane. Whack a bunny, let's do it. I can't whack nothing. Slow start, man. Classic start. Angsty. Is ten even a tween? I don't I don't think so. Maybe. Double digits. That's fourth grade. What was I doing in fourth grade? Pogs? Pokemon cards? Comic books for sure. Alright. Eye itches. Uh, a stump. Okay. A rock. Classic. A sign to read. Very good. Hangman's Woods. Well, that sounds nice. But we are going to take the road less traveled. Come on. Let's go. This is the path to the village, but it's really boring. I'd rather go on adventures. Okay, I guess Hans is not going to let us go to that part of the screen. That's fine, Hans. Thank you. I thought I was in control. Apparently, I was wrong. Let's go sit in this flower bed. Whack these bugs. Okay. We're not whacking any bugs. Oh my god, a person. Oh, a pig. I love pigs. An old woman. Hello, young one. What are you doing here alone? The woods can be really dangerous for a kid. I'm a grown man, lady. I'm ten. Ah. 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 Oh. Well. 
I see you're a man indeed. Perhaps you can help me then. Quest. What's wrong? I was on my way to the market in the village to sell this pig and make some money, but my cane was stuck on some rocks and it broke. I need that support to walk, so I don't know what all what I will do when night falls. Would you by chance have something to help me keep going? I could hand her the cane mom gave me, but she told me it was my grandpa's. To give her the cane, I should take it up from my backpack and show it to her. There you go, lady. Please use this cane. You've given the old woman a cane. Oh, thanks a lot. Your mother should be proud of such a good son. Come on, you darn slacker. Move your ass. Who speaks to their pig that way? Oh my, who whacks their pig? Shh, just whack the devil out of it. Goodbye, son. I hope we meet again really soon, as I can return the favor. Uh, you mean spanking the pig? Pig? Nope, come on, pig. You come with me. No, she doesn't love you. I, I can give you everything you need. Nope, you got some Stockholm syndrome. Come with me. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, this way. No. She's not a good person. She's not good for you. Your taste in old ladies is bad. You know what? Fine. Sometimes you just gotta let people hit rock bottom. I'll eat you in the morning. Alright. Oh my god, an animal. A deer. A secret path right here. Here we go. Okay. Secret path. Okay. No surprises. We're giving this game exactly 10 more minutes. And if I don't get to kill something, or get set on fire, I'm going to stop playing. I don't like ravens at all. Mom said they bring bad luck. Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered weak and weary, <laughs> weak and weary, over many a quaint and curious volumes of forgotten lore. Um, while I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a tapping, as if someone gently rapping. Oh yes, now here we go, this is good. At my chamber door. Tis some visitor, I muttered, tapping at my chamber door. Merely this, and nothing more. It's a broken statue, this place looks like an old abandoned garden. Not only is Hans 10, he is like Sherlock freaking Holmes. Now she's written this in blood or berry juice. Zowie, this looks like it's drawn with blood. Zowie, this... In an old game I used to play called uh, King's Quest by Sierra, uh, the, he always used to say Zounds. Reminded me of that. This is a sewer, but I'm not strong enough to remove the grate. Maybe if you ate some cheese. Oh good, a chest, a weapon, a sword, a new cane. You've got a candle. There's a note. This wall must be part of Tenenbre, Tenenbre Castle. But how can I get across this inch... Insurmountable Barrier, signed by J.F. Yep. There was a person who said, you know what? We're going to put a candle in a chest with a note. And that is going to progress the story, because that makes the most sense. We're also going to have a butterfly in blood. Broken statue. All right, take inventory. Take a uh, inventory. Inventory is literally cheese, nuts, and fire. Okay. So, blood. Okay, raven. Okay, yeah, you don't like ravens. We got it, Hans. All right. Give me some action. You let me ride a horse. I'm in this for for the duration. Oh god, frames are getting a little skippy. Now that's an ass. Thick. Hey, Mr. Donkey, where do you come from? You look hungry. Hey, poor little thing looks hungry. You know what donkey's like? Ooh, hey, look at that, my candle. Donkeys love cheese. 
Oh, I can't. You know what? Set him on fire then. <gasps> Poor thing looks hungry. Yes, we're going to keep this candle out during the day. Because that makes sense. Because we can carry things on fire in our pants. Yes. Burn, squirrel, we will feed you. He's still walking. Okay, he's not going nowhere. Just walking. Good, let's get some apples. Yeah, pick up an apple. We'll feed it to the donkey. This makes the most sense. Yes, got it. Those apples look delicious. If I keep them, I could regain strength later. You got an apple. You got an apple. Kick the tree. Get more down. That's how this goes. Okay, it's fine. Let's go feed it to the ass. Okay, he's going to uh, make it clap, and we will insert it. He will be satiated, and uh, n let us ride him. Don't get... What? I think he likes... Okay, let me choose an apple then. Equip the apple. Feed the apple to the ass. There you go, Mr. Donkey. Eat this apple I've got here. You've given the donkey an apple. Any animation? Okay, it loves me. There you go, Mr. Donkey. Eat this apple. I've... I don't have any apples left. I'm sorry, Mr. Donkey. I don't feel like that advanced my, st my position at all. The Cursed Gorge. Of course. I remember this place, and the raven follows me to let me know that it's a bad sign. Oh god. Somebody's hurt. Merchant, oh, what will become of me? Hey, are you alright? Clearly not. Help, please help. I've lost everything, all the wares I carried for my lord. Even my donkey has gone away. What will become of me? I've seen the donkey down the road. He'll be just scared. My master will punish me anyway. He'll lash me 100 times for not bringing the wares. Perhaps you could strap them to the donkey and resume your journey. You're not hurt, are you? You're a smart kid, but that won't help much unless I bring my master some money to make up for the wagon. He'll punish me hard. You're just a kid. I guess you won't spare some coins, will you? I could give him my money, but my mom told me not to waste it. Oh, oh, poor me. I'll give him a change. Oh. He's stolen two coins. Hey, no, I only wanted to give you one coin. Give me the other one back. All right, kid, don't play the rat here, will you? I'll make it up to you another time, buddy. Hey, guy. Okay, so we met a turd. Oh, wow, look at this. A push mechanic. And it's not working very well, is it? Let's free the goat. Yes, we got you, bud. Here you go. Be free. Go hang out with the ass. Here, I got a candle. Yeah. Oh, I hear something walking. It's probably the goat. Let's follow the goat. Keep the candle out, though. Oh, good. A note on the tree. Help, there's a tree here. I've left a note. How was I ever... All those above 15 shall report to their nearest Jew. Whoa. Gendarmere? G I don't know what that word is. Maybe I'm just an idiot. It's very possible. I hear a distress call. Oh my god, it's a... And they're smoking? Oh my, finally somebody's got something. Hey kiddo. What are you doing on top of the mountain? I'm going in search of fortune. Blimey, that's a big idea. Tell me if you find anything interesting. Are you taking care of these goats? Nope, just sitting here, getting high on a stump, surrounded by all these goats. None of them are real. My goats take care of themselves. Spend the day smoking and playing the flute. <laughs> but hey, ain't your parents worried about you? I don't think so. Besides, my dad went to war. Oh, that's bad. Why? Well, let's say they force you to go to war. Don't know anybody who would choose to go, so it ain't a great place. Oh. And your mom? Ain't she looking for you? I don't care, I'm angry with her, for absolutely no reason. But at least she gave me some food for the journey, but I gave it away. Oh wait, no, I sell the cheese. You mentioned food and my belly 
Me belly ached. Been all day with the goats and forgot to bring something to eat. Took tobacco and wine, but forgot the most important thing. <laughs> I could give him the cheese. Let's give him ooh, a nut. A nut. Let's give him a nut. I've got this chestnut. You can have it if you want. Couldn't do much with a chestnut. Thank you, anywho. Oh, wow. Choosing. Fucking beggar, dude. I've got cheese. You sure? Truth is, your cheese looks delicious and me is starving. Wait. What you think we share? We could have a nice meal with your cheese and your wine. I don't know that a ten-year-old should be getting drunk, but you know what? If it makes this game interesting... Oh, well, here he goes. He's gonna take a kidney. Oh, boy. There you go, Hans. Drink more wine, man. Yes, uh, I think I can't. I'm passed out. Good night. Aha, <gasps> uh -huh. poor boy, you have to take you back home, but first, a final sip. Well, that adventure didn't last very long, did it? Now your dad's gonna come home and beat your ass. Mama. D did she watch me get inebriated? God, she's gonna think less of me than she does already. Okay, an eyeball of red. This is Hans, right? Yes. Oh, we're dreaming. Staring at the large wine raven. Nevermore. Oh my god, that was an intense scene. Did you guys see that? I am literally shaking in my boots. Raven, save soul. Oh my head, I might have fallen asleep. It's pitch dark and I'm freezing, I should head home. I just need to fall the way back, but it's so dark, I better take this candle with me. At least we still have our nuts. This is really an old tomb, it's so worn I can't read the name. Uh, and another one. And... Another one. And by golly. Another one. And last but not least. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright. It's a river of blood. God, we are in... We are in the ethereal hell. Okay. Riveting. Riveting. Okay. I know I, I said I was going to stop, but I mean... Another note? There's a note. I discovered the legend of Count Lucanor on my way back home. I just couldn't get there empty-handed. Signed by... J.F. Jeff. Uh, let me read that again, just in case. Discovered the legend of Count Lucanor. Count, the legend of Count Lucanor. That's the name of the game. Oh my god. Plot advancement. Except now I'm stuck in a place I can't get out of. Alright, we're getting past the screen and, and... Old tombs. Can I get these flowers, maybe? Nope. No flowers. How did I do it? No, that's the river of blood. Okay. Well, maybe I need to go along this bank. Yes. Yes. No. No. Yes. A path. Yes. No. No. Not a path there. Not a path here. Not a path anywhere. Oh my god. Bro. Okay. Well. Maybe this game just takes some time to ramp up, and you don't really get the full impression within the first half hour. Although, the first half hour hasn't left a great impression on me. It's ambitious, and I'm sure there's a great story, but it feels kind of like... They say when you're writing a novel, for instance, 
and you've got the story figured out, and it's all plotted down, what you have to do is take the climax of the story, and that's where you start, on page one. This is the blood of all those who died at the at war. Okay. You've got me for another minute. Dear God, the goat men. What's happening here? Jesus, dude. Whoa, this has to be a nightmare. Hey, buddy. You alright? You look pale. You never trust a goat, can you? This is scary as hell. I want to go home now. Wow, this is kind of scary. Okay. I guess I really do need to find my way all the way back home, huh? Well, first let's see what the zombie donkey looks like. Children named Hans will be hung from the highest tower of the village for skipping war. Jesus. It's taking a dark turn. Oh god, here's the guy from the cover. Huh? Get back here, you little turd, Jester. Okay. Let's at least make it back home and visit our zombie mom. Oh god, dude. Okay, I just got a couple goosebumps. Those bitches are coming after me. Uh, okay, this is, this is bad. Hans, you don't want to be here, dude. Uh, okay, I, can I push both of these? Probably not. Okay. Okay. Zombies are a nice touch. A nightmare is a nice touch. If I could run around, like, twice the speed, I wouldn't be as annoyed. What is this gonna say now? The blue kobolds keep... The blue kobold keeps a great treasure. So this is a kobold. I'm guessing. Alright, dude, you got me for one more minute. Where's the zombie donkey? Oh. Well... Ooh. He's breathing heavy, dude. We're almost back home. Alright. That birdie seems a lot cuter before the sunset. That's it. I'm done. Well. I'm, I don't think I'll be picking this game up again. If you're curious about Han's adventures in uh, his nightmare, those rabbits don't look friendly at all. Oh god, I, I... Take your candle back, dude. Pick it up. Thank you. We have three candles. Uh, how much is this game right now? I know this was like a Switch bed buy. I can't remember how much it was, though. Here, let me check real fast. Just so you know what you're getting into here if you try to go buy it it's normally $14.99 but right now if you go buy it on the eShop Nintendo style it is on sale for $374 which probably was motivational motion motivational for me to give it a go Oh my god, dude. I, uh, now that your mother is gone, you're free, Hans. Oh man, okay, okay. Is there a save? Load soul. Interesting. I don't know what all that means. I probably should give it another, another half hour before I pass judgment, but that's not how I do the Discover Indies thing. I owe it to the developers to give it another half hour, which I will do on my own. Should things pick up, and Hans and the Kobold Vampire Jester Man here make a turnaround, uh, you'll be the first to know, probably on Twitter. Switch under G. Uh, if you enjoyed your timer, give us a thumbs up. Sorry, it was mostly, uh, you know, uh, talking about things and wandering around this pixelated world, or not a whole lot 
what's going on. And uh, we're doing other stuff on the channel as well. You can go ahead and uh, subscribe if you like. We do Diablo stuff. We're playing the Book of Unwritten Tales, and we are playing Sundra the Eldritch Edition. edition. And this particular weekend's going to be a lot of first looky stuff, because yesterday I got, or was it yesterday? A couple days ago I got the um, Child of Light and the Valiant Hearts, the Great War uh, combo deal that Best Buy was doing exclusively. And I played about 10 minutes of Child of Light, and it's kind of slow too. Not as slow as this. But I also played uh, the first part of the Valiant Hearts thing, and that was amazing. I really like that. That might be the next game we play on the channel. This is not about that. This is about Count Lucanor and discovering indie titles. So check it out if you're interested. Be good to each other, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.